I see a ghast out here. Really quick. I want to see if I can get return to sender. Hiya! With a bow. I do it with a bow because I'm a badass like that. Return to sender! Yeah, yeah! You ready for the moment of the truth? Huh? It's a Fletcher! What's up, guys? It's the Doza, and welcome back to the Doza Craft SMP server. Sloppy, sloppy intro. Who cares? So, he's cured. And he's a Fletcher. Huh? I said you're cured. I said I helped you. You're welcome. Um, his first trade is 18 string. I said 18 string. He keeps asking, he keeps like questioning what I'm saying. 18 string for one emerald. Okay. I said, I'm just talking to the people about your trades, that's all. Um, and the second one. It, his second one is one emerald for 11 arrows, and I've been needing arrows lately. I've been running out of arrows like crazy. Um, and something else I found out the hard way was uh, I had it like this before, just kind of caged in like this. And I found out that the zombies can actually reach them through there. So he, he got punched a couple times. So I uh, decided to box it up completely so he's nice and safe. Um, we're going to move him today. I don't know where. Uh, well, I kind of know where, but I, just, I don't know when. Um, but we'll figure it out. Also, I exchanged my pants for some of these pants. Even though they're gold, they're very nice. Um, I need string. Let's get... I, I don't got much string. This is all the string to my name. And let's get some of these. And how many... Let's do some firsts today, huh? Let's do some firsts. Here's my first bed. Let's make our first bed. I have... I slept once, and it was in uh, Theracher's... Theracher's bed. I have not slept since then. Uh-huh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. We got a bed. Perfect. We'll be able to sleep once it's nighttime, which is uh, soon-ish. I'm going to leave that stupid block on the floor because I hate those little singular blocks you get. Um, what else do I need? I wanted to do something. Um, fishing poles. Yeah, I did see some trading. I was looking at my statistics. Mobs. As you can see... There's not any pigs on here. Pigs are sacred on this server. Do not kill pigs. That's the rule. Um, I got 69 sheep killed, and I got six, 68 cows killed. Oh, let's change that real quick. Ah, yeah. Oh, ah, there you go, stupid. There we go. Let's check. Mobs. Uh-huh. 69 cows and 69 sheep. That's it. <laughs> not killing any more of those. Let's save that number forever. No, I'm not. That's childish. Uh, but I did, I did, I saw, I was checking trading. Let's get our shit right, Doza. Uh, that's not where I want to be. General? Yeah, general. Let's go down to the bottom. And it says, traded with villagers five times. And I was trying to remember, what did I trade villagers for? And I remembered, we have a villager at the bottom of, uh, the mob grinder. I think Grutz probably has that footage and might be able to get it for me. Or it'll be on his videos, at least. Um, and I traded a bit with him. Where's the bows? I had a couple bows I wanted to combine. Did I lose them? I might have lost them. Uh, see all the crap I have now, man? I really need to get a house and do some organizing. Wow. Uh, I don't know where my bows are. I had two bows that I wanted to uh, combine. And I guess I lost them? Or somebody took them? I'm not too sure. <laughs> These are all the chests I have, right? I keep going through my same chests over and over again. Huh. Guess not. Guess that's the only bow I have. So scratch that idea. I guess. Um, let's do some trading with this guy. What's this bow? That's definitely not one of my bows. Yeah, I had a couple bows, and they're not here anymore. I don't know what would have happened to them. Alright, let's do some trading with this guy. See what he has to offer. See what trades we can open up and see how far we can get with him. Alright, string first. Actually, let's do let's do this first, since it's the last trade, and he should open up stuff right away. Uh huh. Okay, give me some more trades. Beautiful. Two diamonds for an unenchanted bow. I don't know if I like that. Oh, what's that? Huh? Ooh. I you know I don't I don't know if I like this guy really. Let's do this. Let's do this. Boom. I have one... I have one string left. And you didn't open any, any new trades? You didn't open any new trades. I, I don't like you. 
And he wants 10 gravel for one emerald. Or 10 gravel and one emerald for seven flint. Who needs that? Okay, guy, listen. I'm giving you one more chance. And then I'm just going to make you uh, a zombie zapper guy for spawn. Because that's all you're going to be worth to us. <laughs> Otherwise, I'll feed you to the wolves. I could use you, actually, to breed. I probably should keep you for breeding. Alright, where's that last stupid trade at? Oh, one. I grabbed one gravel. Silly me. Need ten gravel. And then we'll move on with today's video. Gonna do a lot today. Gonna do a lot, a lot, a lot. Probably. Maybe. Um, not my spawn house. I have an idea for spawn, but we're probably going to move out and go somewhere else. And we also have to spend time getting getting a little special guest back to spawn as well. Uh, so we'll do that. It's going to be a long video. Hope you guys enjoy. Enjoy. Okay, so 10 and 1, and you'll give me 7 flint, which I don't want. But I'm doing it for you. Giving you a chance. You didn't open up any new spawns? For real? For... Oh... You're getting on my last nerve, guy. Okay, all right. Well, you lowered you lowered your string price. That's fine. What if I what if I bought some more of these? I kind of want to keep you for the for the uh, arrows as well, huh? How about that? You want to open up anything else? Do you? You want to do anything else? What if I do? What if? Okay, I'm a fool. I'm being foolish now. I'm going to do another flint trade because I'm a fool. I bet these guys only have like four trades total, and they don't they don't have any more than that. And I'm probably just uh, wasting my emeralds and gravel. You make me mad about wasting my gravel, guy. I try to avoid getting flint. Now you're making me get flint. Okay, there. I bought your stupid flint. Will you open up more trades, please? No, he's not. You know why? Because he's a Fletcher, and that's bows and arrows. So everything he has here is the only things in the game. That have to do with bows and arrows. Right? It's too bad this isn't enchanted. That would be very nice. I do like you for the arrows, though. Give me all those. Uh-huh. Okay, one more time. Anything change? No. Matter of fact, that's locked. Wonderful. Oof. Man, you're lucky I don't kill you. But I'm going to keep you, because I'm going to use you to breed. Um, Alright, so is there anything else I wanted to do at this point? particular moment in time sure let's go check out uh the zombie villager here so this is your typical grinder but usually when you see this this is the water ladder right here usually when you see a water ladder on these guys they go up and around and they're like way in the sky and stuff because this is a surface dungeon so it would have uh the water ladder would have been up and it goes up and then drops them down that's the usual one you find well uh me and Grutz designed this one. It was his idea. I kind of did it, and then he came along and tried to make it work a little bit better, because that's that's what he does. And uh, we have it so it drops first, which I don't know why I never thought of that. They drop first, and then they come up to the surface, instead of going up and then dropping down. And we ran into a few problems, because they wouldn't walk into the stream. So what we had to do was we had to get a villager so loud down here. We're gonna get a villager down here and we actually have him right there. And the water stream leads up to him, like it comes along this way, leads up to him so they walk towards him and then they eventually hit the water ladder which brings him up. And that's after a drop, so these are one hit kill now. And it's still accessible through here and the fisherman actually has a better trade for the string than the other guy. He also takes coal, not bad. He also takes one emerald and six fish and he'll cook it for you. What a really crappy... That's a crappy furnace he is. I stole that joke. And he also has this uh, this fishing rod. And I think that's the only trades he has too. Villagers seem to be... There's like more kinds of villagers, but they have less trades on them. So this is like all he'll ever have, from what I understand. And that's the same way with the, with the Fl Fletcher. Felcher. Uh, what's his name? Fletcher? Yeah, right. It's Fletcher, I think. Um, and then this is a little baby, the temporary... We're going to fix this up, by the way. I'm going to dig this all out in here, make rooms out of it, and make it a cool thing down here. And uh, this is just a four-block drop. All the zombies take damage up to one hit. The baby zombies cannot climb up the water ladder, so they fall down here and die. And then everything in here gets picked up by those guys. Oh, he's burning. How is he burning? Oh, he might have been suffocating. 
Um, and the zombies we hear now are somewhere in the caves. Like, I don't know how to get to them. I've tried looking for them. I don't know where they are. Up here, maybe? Let's, let's go, try to go up more. Ooh, there's some more iron. You never go wrong with more iron, like I say. Uh, oh, what's this? Oh, these are my other caves when I was trying to find them. Ah, forget it. Okay. Oh, wait, what's... I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I don't care. Um, so I am going to go and <laughs> go to sleep, IRL, and then I'm going to hit record tomorrow, do some things, get Kapanga on the line, and uh, we're going to we're gonna introduce our special guest, the guy who I gave my shoes. I gave him the shoes off my feet. And then I gave that other villager the hat off my head. And now I have a bunch of crappy armor. <laughs> That's about how it goes. Come here. We got we gotta update this too. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh man! If that would have blown up, that would have been probably the worst news ever. Oh huh, what? You want some skeleton? That's right. Keep walking. Keep. No, oh, he heard me. Don't shoot. Oh, you shot. Give me your armor. I want your boots. Can I have your boots, please. Stop it. Nothing. Okay. Leave him alone. I know he's a horrible businessman. He has really bad ah products to offer. But you can't eat him. He's my horrible business shop owner seller. My words right. All right, let's check this. I almost forgot. I almost forgot, guys, but I didn't. Creeper killed me one time. I have killed 176 creepers. Oh baby, I am almost a quarter of the way. Well, not really, but I'm 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 almost almost a quarter of the way to a thousand and winning ten. Wait, what is it? Nineteen in total. Nineteen diamond ores. Uh, or diamond doors, I wish. 19 diamonds, because two blocks, we win two blocks, like I mentioned, plus the one. And now, since I died to that stinking freaking creeper earlier, now I will owe, owe, owe one diamond extra if I lose this battle. And he's doing pretty good. He's been, like, way ahead of me. He also set this up right here. Deposit all birch into hole. Thanks. Lava. <laughs> I hate, I hate birch too, don't worry. But he hates it even more than I did. And I actually planted a bunch of birch trees here. And I don't know if somebody tore them down or if the lava caught them on fire. But yeah, they were gone when I came back. So, time for me to go to sleep. And I'll see you in like not even one second. But for me, it's going to be hopefully after a good night's sleep. Well, this is kind of from the future. It's a couple days later now. And uh, a lot has happened between then and now, but I haven't had a lot of time to record, and I'm going to try not to spoil too much stuff, although everywhere I look, there's like things to spoil, um, but in the previous episode, I promised that we would introduce our special guest, so I need, let me put some stuff away real quick, um, Zisto, he's back, he is back on the server, he is back joining us, and he is at Kapanga's base, and we need to go there to get him, and I didn't want to do... I didn't want to do that until I was recording, because I haven't gone to the nether yet, and we need to get him here uh, via the nether. And I want to get some better armor on. I've been wearing crap armor. Um, but yeah, I gave Zisto my shoes, that's why I had no shoes in the last episode. And, uh, and since then, all the rest of my armor has broke. So, let's just make a whole new set. There we go, we got a chest piece, we got boots, and we got a helmet. Boom, boom, boom. Give me some pants with that. Thank you. And I got two diamonds out because I want to make a sword. Um, what was it? Was it this one? Yeah, I got this Looting 3 book. I actually bought two Looting 2 books from uh, Unreal, who's online right now. Look, look at my deaths. 13 deaths. Oh my god, just a second ago I had like 7. Didn't I? Or was that... That might be a different clip. No, this is this is future stuff. So there's other clips you... Oh, quit looking around. Those are your spoiling things. Oh, I'm like three episodes behind. I'm so far advanced right now. This I'm Technically, I'm probably in like episode uh, eight as far as content goes. But right now, this is what? Episode six? I don't even know. Um, what was I saying? Um, I want to make a sword. Oh, I got a looting three book. I got two looting two books from Unreal. Combined them together. Got looting three. Um, spent a lot of my diamonds on that. Also, I borrowed his Silk Touch pick. He's got that back since then, but I managed to get seven diamond ore since then, and a couple other ores and things and stuff. Uh, problem I discovered with my Doza's bouncy block right here 
If I place it and jump on it and then break it, when I break it again, it doesn't work anymore. So that sucks. I might have mentioned that already. Uh, my work pickaxe broke. Um, Necro gave me a diamond shovel that had a f uh, blah blah what's it called fortune one on it, and I needed that because I've been using a lot of arrows lately for this bet. Me and uh, Third Church have been having race to a thousand creepers. Let's update that really quick. We'll do this real time. Who cares? I've died six times from a creeper, so that's plus six diamonds. But I have 616 creepers killed. And uh, going by what he says, I'm pretty far ahead of him. Um, so that's that's fun. I can't wait to get this other footage out. Uh... I, I won't put it in this video. It'll be in tomorrow's video, but uh, if you didn't know, Theracher hates Birch, and uh, we pranked him in a snapshot. We, we did the newest snapshot for a minute, but it was uh, there's problems with it, so we actually took it back off and went back to 30C, um, but we pranked him and put some Birch fences and stuff. You guys will probably see that in tomorrow's episode. But then I came here, and I planted one Birch tree, and he burnt his whole house down, <laughs> so his... Uh, this roof is a little leaky. It's getting getting wet on this on this wood here. But this is still here. So let's do a quick enchant. Do I don't I don't want to enchant, do I? I don't want to enchant, but I want to check what's available. Bane of arthropods. God no. Ugh. Wait, did, was that kind of weird? Look at that. Why is that all? Why is that weird? Can you guys see that too? It's like it's weird. That's not what I wanted to do. It's not what I wanted that for. I want to put the looting three on here because uh, you know me. I like my gunpowder, and I've been killing a lot of creepers lately, so I figure, since I also need a better sword, I might as well um, put looting 3 on it and get a lot of good things while I'm at it. Got all this gunpowder here. I got some gunpowder in another project I got going on over there. Don't look. Ah, it's a mighty big tree. Ah, I looked. I looked. You guys looked. Spoiler alert. Uh, tree farm. Spoiler alert. I, I suck. I ruin all my videos. It's fine. Let's put those in there. I got wooden swords because of uh, the zombie spawner over there. And I won't show you that either because, spoiler alert, I've been really busy lately, guys. You guys are going to be proud of me. What am I looking for? The book, for cripe's sake. So I got two looting three books. This book actually came from fishing. And I'm probably... I'm going to use this because all the rest, all the other enchantments on there are a garbage. Uh, stop looking at the spoilers, guys. So there we go, looting three. Actually, you know what I kind of want to do? I did see, I think, sharpness two or sharpness three on that table. So I think, oh, I need, I keep forgetting I need lapis. I think I'm going to enchant. I'm going to enchant, put that little low sharpness on there. And we could build that up over time. But I'm going to put that on there. And then I'm going to put the looting on. Because I don't want to sort of with just looting. I want it to have uh, a little bit of something else. And since we're going to go to the nether today, um, it's going to be necessary because I don't know why. I don't plan on fighting pigmen, but you never know. never know what will happen. So the plan is we're going to walk from here over to Kapenga's house, which is that away, and then we're going to come out of that portal. Quit looking at the spoilers, guys. Come on, man. I just told you. We're going to come through the nether and go to that portal. And as far as I know, I think if, you head, if I head towards 0, zero I should run... Everybody says I should run into uh, the portal pretty easily. So let's do that. And I'm guessing... Oh, there's no place... Oh, this is weird. This is like a 1.7.9 uh, setup right here. Tw what? 24? Is there a... There's a torch. Break that stupid torch. Get out of there. I need 30. Actually, I don't need 30, do I? What a useless... What am I doing in my life? Oh, I'm breaking 2. That's what that is. Oh, I'll do I'm breaking 2. We'll do I'm breaking 2 and uh, the looting 3. That's fine. Just some breaking too. No big deal. I am cool with that. We can get uh, sharpness things later on. I don't know what they're saying in the chat. It's really awkward in the when when you watch a video and uh, people say things in the chat that are kind of strange. And uh, you don't even know it while you're recording and you don't see it until... Now you guys are going to be watching the chat for the rest of the video, aren't you? There we go. B what? Oh, this has Bane of Arthropods on it too. Crap. That's not good. I didn't want that to happen. Um, uh, so this costs 10 levels to put on, and I think that's because it's putting two different things on. So what if I just use... I thought I saw an arrow on the ground. 
Uh, what if I just use the other book? You see all the goodies I got, guys? I've been busy, I'm telling you. It's been a little while since I was able to record, but... Um, after this week... Seven levels, that's good. After this week, things should be... Um, I should be able to record a little bit more. Okay, so let's put this away. This is just my walk around, build, work stuff. Armor. I'm gonna go to Kopenga's place. Is there anything else I need? I don't have another name tag. I need a name tag. Hmm. Yeah, look at my bow. Great bow. This is my other bow right here. Great bow. You guys will learn more, more later. Learn learn it. Okay, so I'm going to run over to Kapenga's place, and then we, we will get Zisto back to spawn. Wow, I actually found the place. Kind of surprised. Um, so I wanted to do this with Kapenga, and we kind of had plans... By the way, hold up. By the way, I phone dying, or phone complete charge. Take that off. Shut up. Quit beeping at me. Um, I turned Faithful Texture Pack back on. Do you guys like it? The trees look kind of weird. But uh, I haven't been using it because I thought maybe the new blocks would be out of date and wouldn't work and would show up kind of glitchy or whatever. But they look fine. I mean, there's no new blocks to be seen around here, really, but like the andesite and the... See, look, this. Like, great. That's, uh, that's granite. Looks just fine. I, th I figured it'd bug out. That's why I've been using the vanilla texture pack. Um, but yeah, I wanted to do this with... Uh, Kapanga, but he hasn't been online. We, we kind of made plans to, to do it, but uh, he hasn't been on lately. Uh, this is going to be kind of hard. So I think what I need to do is I want to do this on camera because I have not been to the nether yet. I haven't got the achievement. So I want to go to the nether, find the way back to spawn, figure out a pathway that we could go, and then I want to get this guy in a cart and get him from here to spawn via cart. And it's going to be a pain in the ass, I feel like. So let's hop in the nether first and find our way back to spawn. And then we got to make rails and all that happy junk. Let's go through. And we are deeper. We have gone deeper. I finally got the achievement. Oh, the leg, the leg, the leg. Here we go. Oh, man. I haven't been in the nether for so long. Nobody told me congrats either, jerks. Not even Grutz. Grutz is the Grats guy. Oh. Okay. Oh, we're not far at all. We're like 40 blocks away. Um, so we need to go diagonally that way, it looks like. It looks like he probably already has some pillars laid down. That's going to be kind of crazy to do. We're up at 65. I don't know what... Okay, let's just walk there. I'm assuming it's these torches. Uh, it's going to be a, it's a weird path. Got to go alongside a lot of uh, a lot of lava pools. Does this go straight up to it? Uh, it's basically at zero zero, from what I understand. And whoa, ooh, oh wow, is that it? Holy moly, what is this? What's this business? What's going on here? Oh, oh, that opened. Okay, <laughs> probably should have figured that. This is interesting. Nice little portal room, I guess. Um, we will have... We will have another hub eventually where everybody can have their own tunnels to their own places and stuff like that. This just goes up here. That's cool. That's cool. So this will be a lot easier, actually. I am still going to grab some cobblestone and make a pathway so it's a little bit easier than that. And so... Okay, so what's up with this? Let me go through here. We're going to do this, guys. Don't worry. What's that about? Why? Why would there be a portal right here and a portal right here? Why? Who did that? Whose portal is that supposed to be? That's silly. You guys ever played Minecraft before? You ever, you ever laid down portals before? So I'm assuming this goes straight to spawn. This might not be the one, but we... That's another thing I need to do. I need to move this. Oh yeah! We're here! We are here. Great. Perfect. Awesome. So, while we're on the topic of mobs, and while I'm going to look down and not spoil what's to the left of me, or the right of me, I got two more villagers, zombie villagers here. These are both my guys. And we also have... Uh, I also have another one down there. So now... Doza Jackie is griefing ban her. Lol. Um, now I'm going to make some tracks. I have some tracks in here somewhere. I believe, I believe, I believe... Um, and I'm wondering, do I have any golden apples? Because we should... Let's, no. No, let's not do that now. 
Um, I'm gonna make some tracks. I don't have a whole lot of iron. And, uh, make a furnace minecart and all that fun junk. And then we will get Zisto here. And I'll have to also build him a place for him to sit. Whoo, boy, I thought I was out of iron for a second. I got 51 blocks still. Okay, so we made, <laughs> I made all, all these tracks, like a stack and a quarter. And I was like, well, I hope that's going to be enough because that's all the iron I have. And then I saw that I have 51 more blocks. So we're good on that. I'm going to put this stuff away too. Um, we got some things to pillar with. I got some of this useless redstone crap. Uh, I'll just use that to lay the tracks on and just probably leave it in there. Uh, red, red stuff, whatever it's called. Furnace. I need a furnace. I need a furni. I will take this furnace. That's wrong because... Plural of furnace is fern eye and not singular doza get your shit right. Oh, and I do need this actually I do need that uh, What's it called coal? All right, let's go back through the nether. I'm recording in full screen right now also So that's fun. Hopefully we're in 720p. Otherwise uh, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I don't know what what to do because I can't figure out how to get it out of 480p. That's all I got. That's all I got is 480p. And that sucks. Uh, this isn't the right way. Let's go this way. Why are you open? Is this supposed to stay open like that? I guess so. Okay. How did we get here? We got here. Over here. Okay. So. And then we want to go up there. Right? Yeah, so let's start right here with this red with this red block. It's pretty much like cobble. You, you know how, uh, well, it's pretty much like dirt or gravel. You know how you use it to, like, pillar up and uh, not much else. Well, that's, it's, that's what this red, this red, um, red stuff is for. It's mainly for just, like, scaffolding and pillaring up and stuff like that. And, uh, whoops, dropped one. Accidentally dropping in that lava. That was my fault. And and also, just as useless block as this redstone, or red, is it redstone? Is granite. Granite looks not bad. Smooth granite, I don't like, but it has a dirt texture almost. And I feel like if we mix dirt, granite, and uh, the coarse dirt together, we might be able to, like, make something kind of cool with that and uh yeah that's the thing now we want to dig up dig up dig up dig up and are we here yet where is where's the thing back so we go over here where's the portal back to Kapengas? that's what we need to find next i think it's right up here if i i think yes there it is okay let's just lead it right through here dig this out Lots of random talking, trying to keep, keep the fun, keep the fun. I've been hearing there's, it's, people haven't been finding much soul sand. I have my, I have my render distance turned down a lot more since I'm recording, but a lot of people say they can't find, oh, there's a horse, there's a donkey there. I am not supposed to do that. Um, yeah, soul sand, I guess, is hard to find. So we might have to look for that too. I was asking for two soul sand from anybody. Because I needed it for the uh, zombie grinder at spawn. And a lot of people were saying, nope, I don't got any. I can't even find any. So that, that was the thing. Let's do that. Uh, we'll just leave that open. I hope you don't mind, Kapanga. I'll try to remember to clean this up after I record. If not, you might find some weird structures here. So we just want to build this up just so he can't escape um, before we need him to. Besides out that little door. Maybe if we put this here, he won't run out, maybe, possibly? I don't know. I don't know. Can I, like, shift-click on the portal block? Oh, I can. Check that out. Shift-click on the portal animation guy. You can place blocks on it. That's kind of cool. All right, bring this through here. How long is this video? Holy crap. I had, like, a 40-minute video the other day. Didn't even know it. I don't have any kind of timer technology, like I've mentioned. I think it was right down here, right? Let's go down, 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 down. Straight down there. That's where we want to go. That is where we want to go. Also, in the last episode, when we were moving around the villagers, and there was obviously two rails that were missing, and I was like, why is this not working? Honestly, on my screen, I saw rails there. Oh, that, 
That redstone block scared the crap out of me for a second, for some reason. Um, on my screen, there was a rail there. So I wasn't being a complete moron and like, hello, there's no freaking, you know, thing there. It was on my screen and didn't show up in the recording. Kind of interesting. Um, we don't have full rails all the way there, obviously. And there's obviously a rail missing there. I'm going to take it from the end. And there's another portal right there. What is wrong with these people? Have they never made portals before? Whoa, oh, that pick broke. Glad I have another one. Um, whoa, I feel like I'm explaining so many things, different things at once, that I don't even know what I was trying to get to in the first place. Uh, we don't have all... We don't have all the rails we need, but that's that's okay because we could just break it and then put it back on again. I had to pause because I literally had to get my train of thought because I had so many things on my mind. But there's also a bug with uh, carts, and if you have mobs in them, um, they escape. Like if if you push them in a cart into like a one wide spot for them to sit, like like say I put Zisto in this one wide spot via cart and I put blocks all around it. When you break the block, they can actually get out. So that's that's a thing. Uh, so we'll, when we move him, we're just going to keep him in the cart. Maybe? I don't know. Maybe we won't even have him in the cart. Still need to find a place for him at spawn. For now, we'll probably just let him sit somewhere comfortably. Uh, but yeah, as, as you can see, he's got my shoes on. Oh, how long is this video, guys? You tell me. Leave in the comments below. How long is this video right now? What is the time on the video at this very moment? Ah. Get up there, Zisto. Can I push him up a block? That'd be that'd be great. He won't go up. He won't go up. Okay, I need slabs. Here's another thing. If you want to save on coal and you want to make stone slabs, take advantage of the snapshot. The granite, the andesite, and the diorite all make regular stone slabs when you put them in slab form on the crafting table. Did he already go through? Oh, he did. Okay, he did. He's ready to go back. He's ready to go to spawn. He's ready to find his rightful place. Ugh. Zisto? There you are. Hello. Oh, you're already in the... Are you in the cart? I'm freezing. Are you in the cart, Zisto? Oh, come on. Get out of the stupid... There you go. All right. Yeah, we don't even need... We don't even need the stinking... Actually, yeah, we do, because there's a hill we got to go up. Um, but we don't need the minecart furnace yet. Oh, let's get it ready. Let's get it on the bar. Get all that stuff ready break all this because we need a lot more tracks I'm so glad we don't have to go as far as I thought we did um, and I'm also I need to move that uh, portal up way up into the ceiling in the usual place we have uh, the, the the hub and for a while uh, Grutz was mentioning something about um, avoiding having using the nether for transportation this season because uh, I think once we get a nether hub and people make tunnels and it's easier to travel far distances on land, I think that makes people want to move out further even more. So uh, so if we don't use the nether for transportation much or we don't encourage it much or, you know, maybe it will prompt people to live closer together. So that's kind of an idea, but I do want to have another hub just because just because. I don't know. It just seems necessary. You know what I mean? It seems like one of those things that we just gotta have. But we are gonna try to live close to each other. Um, and I'm dropping my rails everywhere, I'm sure. Okay, now let's get this up here. I'm, I'm gonna do the rest of this off camera. You guys know what I'm doing. And honestly, it'll work a lot easier for me if I could just do it off camera. So I'm gonna do that. And then we will. I'll see you at spawn and we will find a little place for Zisto to hang out. Okay, we got Zisto through, and I figured out something crazy about these blocks. Uh, so these doors magic, or <laughs> these doors, these doors magic. These doors open by some magical force, and uh, I think it has to do with this redstone weird weirdness. Was it? Was there something here? No, there wasn't. There's something is weird about this redstone block stuff, but I, I placed it right here. And it actually it makes the magic door happen. So I don't know I don't know how that works. Some kind of strange technology. Um, I don't know if it has to do with that red that red stuff, but uh, it's kind of cool. So I guess I could take all this out. Made a little temporary spot for Zisto. Let's get in here really quick. Yeah. So we made a little temporary spot for Zisto, and it'll probably move at some point. I think. 
um, just until spawn takes a little more shape and we figure out what is where. Like, for instance, Town Hall was going to be in the middle, but I don't think it's going to be in the middle anymore. It's probably going to be somewhere else. Oh, where are you going, Zisto? You can't go back to the Nether. You are in the overworld now. You are you are our guest. Okay, go up the hill. Go up the hill. Okay, no, come back. He's not coming back. You know what? Fine. I didn't want to have to do it. I did not want to have to do it, but I'm going to use the furnace minecart, Zisto. You made me do it. You pushed me. Push it to the limit. Nice boots. Where'd you get them? Hmm? Where'd you get those boots from, Zisto? Oh, your friendly friend Doza? How about you listen to me once in a while? I'll ask you for favor. Just, just go in there. So there is, <laughs> there is the cart glitch, like I said. Hopefully the cart glitch doesn't cause too many problems. It's going to catch up to him, push him up the rest of the way. There we go. See? You thought it was useless at first. Um, there is, they do kind of glitch out of blocks. This minecart thing is going crazy. But let's, let's hope that block glitch and stuff doesn't happen here. Let's take these back. That's going to bother me too, that dirt not turning to grass. I had to kind of flatten this hill a little bit. Hopefully, he probably will. But hopefully he doesn't glitch out of there. And, uh, and the reason this is these though, and not just any other zombie pig man, is because he can wear armor. So that's important, because we want to be able to dress him up later on. I'll get my tracks back in a minute. Let's see if we can break this cart without hurting him, without him escaping. Hiya! Are you in there? I think you're in there. Yeah, you're good. You are good, Zisto. Perfect. Great. So Zisto is on the server. That took a little longer than, than normal. But I hope you guys like this episode. Um, I am recording in full screen. As of now, as of the, the Faithful Texture Pack stuff and this whole adventure getting Zisto, I am recording in full screen. So hopefully this footage at least is a little bit better. It might still be in... F oh, stop looking over there, guys. You keep looking over at the spoilers. Um, this footage hopefully is good. The whole video might be in 480p, but this footage in particular might be good. Because I did some different things. My screen resolution is different. Uh, and just crazy things have happened. And I've been doing crazy things. Trying to get the videos up in 720p or higher. I really hope you guys are still supporting me at least and still watching my videos even though they're in the 480p with really small screen really annoying i know i know guys i know but thank you guys for watching click look at that no damage on the armor no no use of the, the sword we didn't even need that the nether rain a scary place guys it's really not it's a really simple place to be but yeah thank you guys for watching click the annotation at the top right to watch the next video i said annotation i slurred a little bit because i'm tired don't judge me oh i need sleep okay thank you guys for watching Love, peace, and chicken grease. Peace the fuck out.